It's funny, I often hear or read people arguing if coffee is healthy or not. Is this even still debatable? Coffee contains hundreds of different compounds, many of which do contain health benefits. And in this video, we're looking at four of the best. Coffee is the biggest source of antioxidants in the Western diet. When hot water runs through the coffee grounds, the compounds in the coffee beans mix with the water to become part of the drink. Caffeine is the most well-known compound, of course, but there are many that act as antioxidants in the body, protecting us from oxidation. Without getting into complicated details, oxidation is thought to be one of the main mechanisms behind aging and some common diseases like cancer and heart disease. Coffee, believe it or not, happens to be the biggest source of antioxidants in the Western diet, in some studies outranking both fruits and vegetables combined. For people who eat a standard Western diet, coffee may actually be one of the healthiest aspects of their eating pattern. Coffee can improve energy levels and brain function. After you drink coffee, caffeine is directly absorbed into the bloodstream where it makes its way up to your brain. In the brain, caffeine blocks an inhibitory neurotransmitter called adenosine. This increases other neurotransmitters like norepinephrine and dopamine, leading to enhanced firing of neurons. The most obvious result is it helps people to feel less tired and a surge or increase in energy levels. But many controlled trials and functional imaging studies shows this stimulatory effect improves various aspects of brain function as well, including memory, mood, vigilance, and reaction time. Caffeine can help you train harder. Caffeine increases epinephrine levels, also known as adrenaline, in the blood. This is the fight or flight hormone designed to make our bodies ready for intense physical exertion. It's no surprise that studies consistently show caffeine can improve physical performance by 11 to 12% on average. This is actually why pretty much all pre-workout supplements contain a large dose of caffeine. Now instead you could have a strong cup of coffee about 30 minutes before you do any exercise uh, to have the same effect. Coffee can help you burn fat. Did you know caffeine is found in just about every commercial fat burning supplement? The reason is because it's one of the very few natural substances that has been shown to improve metabolic rate and fat metabolism. Several studies show that caffeine can boost metabolic rate by between 3 to 11 percent. Other studies show that caffeine can specifically increase the burning of fat by as much as 10 percent in obese individuals and 29 percent in lean people. The caveat is that the effects on overweight and obese people seem to be much weaker than on lean people. Additionally, uh, as an individual's tolerance to caffeine increases, the effects start to diminish. In this instance, cycling coffee consumption on and off would help, but I wouldn't expect any miracles. Uh, the reality is you won't really lose weight unless you dramatically improve your diet. Thanks for watching. If you found this video useful, please give it a thumbs up and be sure to subscribe to the Authority Nutrition YouTube channel by clicking the big red button below this video.